Hey there folks, it's Lane with Windows10Update.com and today I want to share with you three different ways that you can capture screenshots in Windows 10. So the first option is if you have a keyboard that has a print screen button, you can use that to capture a screenshot. All you need to do is hold down the Windows key and then press the print screen button. You should see your screen dim for just a moment and that will capture the screen right there. The next option that you have is pre-installed in Windows 10. You can just search in Cortana, just search for snipping tool. So the snipping tool will open up, it's a desktop app. And then what you can do is you can actually create a free form snip, which is where you draw using your cursor. You just draw a, uh, an area on the screen and it will capture that specific thing. You can do a rectangular snip where you kind of create a shape uh, using a rectangle. Uh, and then you can do a window snip, which will just snip that particular window that you have in the foreground. And then lastly, you can do a full screen snip, which is just taking a screen capture of the entire screen. And then Microsoft does also have a third option, which is a lot more modern. It's basically the modern version of the snipping tool. It's called Microsoft Snip. You can download that from mix.office.com slash home slash setup snip. I'll leave a link in the description for that so that you don't have to type that whole thing in. Uh, but you can download that and then run it. It's a very light application and you can have it run all the time. Now you can do a capture like this where you just go ahead and select a portion of the screen. So that's one way that you can do that. And then that will copy to the clipboard. You can then go ahead and edit that snip. So you can draw on it. You can even record a voiceover if you are maybe wanting to share something specific, maybe teach somebody how to do something in Windows, you can do that. You can then save that, share that, or copy it. In addition to that, you can also just use a whiteboard, which gives you a blank canvas that you can then use the Snip Editor to draw on. And those were three easy ways that you can capture screenshots in Windows 10. Thanks for watching.